right, so here we are today. We're gonna get to run the new flex polisher on some oxidation where the decals have been removed on this sea chaser. And I'm gonna be using Heavy Cut by their Max's line at McKee's 37. And uh, we're gonna see how awesome this goes. Okay, so this has been a one pass, just a little patch here and around the letters a little bit on this side and uh, still making our way around still making our way around in this area but just wanted to give a glance at it and I started out using both of the different style cutting pads so you'll see the regular red line and then you'll see their new waffle pad I'm torn they both work very good I've always liked that one anyway, and these are definitely cool. Um, and they remind me of the uh, chemical guys that I actually did used to use. Uh, one thing that they ever made that I liked the most was probably their pads. And uh, before I met with McKees, I did use those, but I switched to Redline, and I used this style for quite some time now. And I'm sort of torn. I think that the old style might be better. When you look at it in a certain angle, you barely see the fading anymore at all. So it's definitely taken off a ton of the oxidation now. Some of it is the color itself actually faded. And because it's black, it's going to be a little harder to hide. But I really think he's going to be happy. And this is without wet All right, so this is a single pass, one side of the boat, using the heavy cut that you can get from Nautical One or Max's, they're the same. And it's come out real nice. I've only done the black, but that used one battery in a single pass and turned out really nice. That's no sanding and just switching up two pads, trying out both the the old and the new design and switching back and forth they both work very well all right so we have finished it up with ceramic polish and we're gonna have one happy customer really enjoyed using the flex polisher today and we're wrapping it up I'll give you a view of both sides right quick let you see the main thing we were doing was compounding the black, but I went ahead and covered the white as well with the polish. And uh, since it had the ceramic protection, it made it super slick and it looks really good.